on the uh, Capcom Fighter stream right now. <coughs> they have that uh, LCQ champ, Nemo versus Punk. We've got Tokido versus Ricky Ortiz. Look at that, 2,125 points. Second place in terms of points, 1,000 behind Punk. Crazy to think about is that uh, difference. You see this Footsie specialist in this, that, that, those are the two things that I love the most about Ricky Ortiz's game, but dang, he gonna hit him with the, <laughs> with the, the Chun Li pose. <laughs> That's so sick. Tokyo holding strong with the, with the Akuma pose. All right, Shun Goku Satsu, I see you. Yeah, and I'll tell you this. I'll give you guys real facts. I saw Tokido early in the venue today. He had the tape measure. <laughs> I can promise you I've seen it in person now. I can say that it's real. He was measuring the distance. He's called somebody over here. He's like, you, a tournament guy. This screen, you see this? It gets blurry after just a split second. Yeah. That means it's too far. You it, see the tape measure? Look at the tape measure, okay? I got to be exactly 28 and a half <laughs> inches from this monitor, bro. How do you think I hit confirm? Look, man, we've seen Tokido do some amazing things from Jenga to Street Fighter. Tokido is to the Guilty. Jenga. I've seen him do it all, man. He's the Jenga world champion. Don't ever think that the he The Street won't. Fighter world champion. <laughs> Let's begin. He's all done right. it all. And uh, until someone wins Capcom Cup this weekend or Tokido is out of the tournament, he is the reigning champ. Evo is that event. It's the, it has all that prestige for a reason. It is, makes you the world champion of whatever game you play in, right? It is that kind of prestige. And uh, that's who we're looking at here. Echo Fox's Tokido versus Evil Genius's Ricky Ortiz. Putting the genius brand on her back, mm -hmm. Ricky Round Ortiz. One. Man, I love this Thailand stage. Right? Yeah, we haven't seen Ricky play in quite some time. I know, right? I'm about this outfit, though. I can tell you that. Right, nice throw just to start that neutral again. And yeah. fighting back to the middle of the screen already, you see Tokido. And this is where Ricky's going to struggle, right? Is this, this kind of offense from Akuma where he can just pressure, pressure, pressure all day. Ricky really needs to keep it in the neutral work. Whip punishing and ground game is going to be her specialty. And we've seen some amazing Akuma play this weekend overall. I mean, none better than Tokido. Ooh, Ooh nice. Yeah, big fierce. Those will add up. you got to be careful. And Ricky very good about hit confirming those back medium punches and fierces into V-Trigger. Ooh, wow. Tries to answer back with a crouch light punch, and that is going to be it. Six hit combo to close that out with that forward bar punch. Ricky was looking for wake up buttons, and that forward heavy punch Ooh. from Akuma right over. Standing bar punch from Tokido. Ducks under, commits a little too hard, standing medium kick on the punish. Yeah, move is unsafe. That crouching heavy punch from Chun Li, the two hits. All right, I like this. The puts is right now. Ricky trying to fight her way out of the corner. Demon walk under. The walk under. There we go. I saw a couple of attempts at a low profile earlier, but there you go. Just walk out of that EX range. And I feel like that's going to be one of the better tools that Chun-Li has in this matchup in that pussy range. That forward or back medium punch. I feel like it's yep, so good. That one right there. Yep. The little chomp that she throws out. Very good to hit confirm in a V-Trigger. Back throw. Late back throw from Ricky Ortiz. Ooh. Oh, no. Trigger active. Gets that DP knockdown. Still fighting out of the corner. Tokido trying to get approach started with these double air fireballs and trigger. With the dash under from Ricky. The walk-up throw. And that's a round for Ricky Ortiz. A lot more composed kind of ground game that added up, you know. I love the reactions to Demon Flip as well as Jump. That says a lot about how prepared, how much knowledge is attached to this Ooh. matchup already. What an attempt. Still yeah. made it out alive unscathed, actually. Yeah, whip punish, but Tokido with the awareness gets the punish afterwards. It's smart. Yeah, tough to challenge that out of the air, the Demon Flip. Okay, first wake up EX Spinning Bird, Sir Retro. I'm, I'm counting on you. Let us know the stats. Buffer on that standing medium kick and Tokido with the knockdown. I like the crouch strong. Nice push to the corner. I'm, I really like the defense so far. It's just a few openings that gives Tokido so much ground. He oh, the gray offense. damage and chip. Oh, oh it did. Wow, so that took off so much damage. <laughs> it was a grip. There was tons of gray damage added up. Those EX red fireballs, uh, they're plus eight. You know, a couple of frames there. So you really have to respect that advantage afterwards. And Ricky did, but all that gray damage and chip adds up. I think it's really cool how we see how effective uh, the Grey Life uh, add up. No chip kill unless critical art has changed the, the meta of playing Street Fighter. You still have to worry about chip damage, but even more so, you got to worry about that Grey Life on the back. Exactly. Oh, <laughs> the jungle into the uppercut. So Kido adding up that damage. He's the champ for a reason, you know. Oh, try to armor through with the V skill, Tokido. Bringing out some uh, some really strong stuff in this matchup. I like the buttons to deal with jump and demon flip, but Tokido still finds a hit. Small combo, wake up buttons, get a spinning bird kick back. Air legs confirm Ricky. Yeah, what year is it? <laughs> Seeing air legs 50 50. Tokido goes in the front this time. 
I love the low profile. Like I said before, dealing with demon flipping is pretty good, but Torpedo finds a market in that. Oh no, up nothing. It's an overhead. What oh, a block. What a block, Ricky. Find the activation, the full CA on deck. And oh, there, there it you is, go. the cancel. Not sure if this will be enough damage, though, even with the low life of Akuma. We'll see what the last hit does. Oh, Close. wow. Mix up now. Oh, oh the head stomp. I see you. Pretty Ricky Ortiz, I see you. The head stomp on the other side for cross up. Tokido doesn't get the block. Huge comeback from Ricky. I feel like this outfit is inspired by something that Ricky would wear. I'm just, I'm just being real right now. Casual wear. Oof. Snapping oh, out those buttons. Butt. Now. Yeah, you got to be careful. You don't want to. Oh, wanna... crush counter. Ricky. You don't want to eat a lot of those. They add up real quick. Oh, nice back dash to get out of the way of that demon flip throw. Go Count. for it to challenge. Ricky looking good. Look at those footsies. Did you see the little shimmy right there? Oh, the jump in too. Uh oh. One, one now for Tokido. Side switch problem for Ricky. Demon is available as well, plus full CA. Oh, Demon will kill. Now the dash demon and oh, it connects. Man, I, I didn't see it coming. Neither. I didn't hear any buttons or anything. Die 1,000 deaths. Why do you think the tape measure is there, Steve? He's got to measure the distance You're on right. the dash so that the demon. You're right. You're right. Every time. Dash Demon from Pokito hides the buttons in but, that dash. But look at the resources Ricky goes into this potential uh, match point right here. You see Tokido? He realizes Ricky hitting those big heavy buttons, buffering the mediums from very far away. And look at the catch. range that it now controls because she's putting those buttons there. Ooh. It means he has to stay at this range. He's reaching with bigger buttons, and it's not going to work against Chun-Li. All right, Demon Flip low. That's how Tokido has been getting in, right? Abusing that Demon Flip. Look at that forward medium punch. So good. Oh, and the air again. Once again, these buttons from Ricky to stop this air approach is what's kept her in this match. And that low forward is death now if it lands. The throw. Another one, Ricky and that's Ortiz. a game. Pretty Ricky Ortiz puts one on the board. That's what I like to see. We got one apiece here. Evo champion Tokido. With a lot of really strong measures in this matchup, right? You do the shallow demon flips from far away into the slide to throw off the anti-airs from Chun-Li and stuff like that. But yeah, the ground game is adding up now. Ricky's footsies, as you mentioned, her biggest strength, and you can see it. Yeah, snapping out those roundhouses and fierces. It means Tokido has to go to the air. Changes everything, like I said before. Like, and the dashing in just a little too anxious right there. Nice block. Yeah, air approach again. Tokido needs that. This ground game, not always going his way. Takes the throw, very close to stun, but the wake up bird. Ricky, I think two for two with those wake up EX spinning birds. Yeah. E trigger available for Ricky as well. I like the challenge with that four medium punch. Give him a little time to see if he's going to hit a button or go for a throw. Bam, stick it out there. Does not activate the trigger off the slide. There's no bar for Ricky, so. Oh, oh my god, the shimmy, the travel size shimmy. The mini shimmy. Oh. Eight ounces. Close to stun, or could it be one oh. more hit? Ricky jumps over. The activation, one guess here. Oh Plus frames. Oh, oh my god, no. Oh man. Did the extreme zoom? The extreme zoom. Get in there. We want to see every, uh, every pore on that Tokido face. Anti air, Tokido takes the offense. Anti air oh. from Ricky on the demon flip, not easy to do. What a challenge. Back these, they are slugging right now. They are actually fighting right now. Pretty even on life, too. Yeah, see, anti air attempts a no go. That demon flip has a lot of different trajectories to try to throw off those anti airs. This is the situation we saw Ricky not fare too well in last time. Oh, what? Walk forward after the crush like it. Throw. Okay, cancels in the full CA. That's going to hurt. Ricky with a lot of resources plus V-Trigger, but in trouble for sure. I like that. The X fireball just to get the middle of the screen back. Ooh, I thought that she was going to clear and did not work out 2-1 right now in favor of Tokido. Of course, this is three out of five the rest of the way. So you guys are going to get an extra match. Yeah, three out of five this entire tournament all the way through. Oh, man, that sucks. That situation where Ricky cornered her, so that was her round. That was her game. That jump over in the corner. Whoa, low forward, bird. Missed Ooh. the air legs there. So now is? Tokido with the corner. Ooh. Crushed. No buttons there. Yes, didn't space get the spacing on the back fears he was looking for, but stun it is. A couple of uh, chances now in this corner where Tokido's really opened up with the offense. 
is where Akuma shines, right? Probably the best corner game in the game. Yeah, with that walk speed and those buttons at his disposal, it's really hard to amount, uh, collect that offense once after getting knocked out. Back throw from Ricky, not out of the jet. Full trigger, working. Oh, anti-air. Oh, Ooh. tried the air legs to float over. But Tokido, that V-trigger uppercut, huge vertical hit box. Snapping out those fierces again. That button, the huge jump. Not strong again. What a confirm. Gonna push to the corner this time around. Air legs. No bite from Tokido. The walk under. What a low profile. Using that walk speed. Who stuffed the stuffed. demon flip? Yeah, that was demon flip throw tech OS. That floaty tattoo to get out of danger. I respect it. Life looking really good for Ricky. Another low profile to get under that jump in. Gets thrown back into the corner. Tokido making an offensive push right now. There's the trigger activation. EX to try to fight her way out of that corner again. There's an activation from Tokido, and this is very well hurt. Very close to the end of this one. Mix up now to kill. Ricky gets clipped, and that's going to be that. The set for Echo Fox's Tokido. Akuma wins. That was a really good set to start today, though. I could tell you that. Mm -hmm. That was really, uh, you can see the adjustments from Tokido. He recognized the importance of the uh, the air approach, right? And that kind of a matchup where you're out uh, outmatched on the ground in terms of your character's options, it's really important to open up that air game to make them focus on something else. So you start to jump, you start to demon flip and stuff like that. So Ricky's like, okay, I got to watch the air. And then that's when Tokido can approach on the ground afterwards. The utility um the, the utility of the normals and some of the options coming from Ricky and Chun-Li actually was, like, I'm really, it really impressed me. 